Hi, my name's Grace and I'm currently a second year medical student studying at Cardiff University. So I went to Radha Sixth Form where I completed my A-levels and the subjects that I chose to study were biology, chemistry and maths. So the reason that I chose to study chemistry is because it is mandatory in most medical schools. Um, but also it was my favourite subject at GCSE, so that worked out quite well for me. Um, the reason that I chose to study biology is that um, lots of medical schools recommend um, for you to study another science subject as well as chemistry and I felt that biology would be the most useful subject for me to have um, and in my experience as a medical student there has been a lot of um, content studied during A-level biology that's come up in medicine so I would recommend biology if you're considering medicine. And then the reason that I chose to study maths is because it was probably my strongest subject at GCSE. Um, and I also thought that it would benefit me in medicine because maths is used pretty much everywhere. Um, one thing I will say, if you are considering um, medicine as your um, future university um, study, um, don't feel that you have to study maths just because lots of other applicants do. Um, it is a popular choice, um, however, if you feel that um, you're not very good at maths or you just don't enjoy maths, don't feel that you have to study it. Um, a lot of the medical students that I know um, didn't actually take maths. Um, for example, three of my best friends, none of them did. Um, one of them did PE, the other did geography and the other did Spanish. So all very diverse subjects. Um, and they are obviously all here now in medicine so you don't have to do maths if you don't want to. Um, some general advice that I would give in terms of picking your A-levels, definitely pick A-levels that you think you'll enjoy as well as being good at. Um, you know you want to you want to study and revise these subjects and if you don't enjoy them you're not going to want to do that so make, de definitely pick subjects that you think you'd enjoy. Um, Another thing I would say, if you have an idea of what you want to do after A-levels, you can try and pick subjects that like align with their requirements. So if you know, if you've got a course at university in mind, have a look at the subjects that they like. Or if you've got maybe some an apprenticeship in mind or any anything else, just have a look at what they require and you could pick your A-levels based on that. Um, if you are struggling with this process in any way, like maybe you're struggling to decide which A-levels to pick or you're struggling just with the application process as a whole, feel free to pop down to the sixth form um, with any questions that you have and they'd be more than happy to help you out with it and answer any questions. Um, the sixth form does have a really good support support network. If you have any issues, they will support you throughout sixth form and they provide many opportunities as well, whether that be like within sixth form or for after sixth form. So... Yeah, um, really, really good, um, really, really good support. So to round it up, I had a great time studying my A-levels at Radha Sixth Form. Um, excellent support, excellent opportunities. Um, and the teaching is really, really good. Um, and I wish you all the best of luck in your future ambitions.